Alrighty guys, this is my video of my S95B, this is playing Sonic the Hedgehog HDR with my max settings running after I boosted the luminance and I have things set for super duper colorful and beautiful. Um, I, I, it's going to be hard for you to tell just looking from a phone video, but this is what I've got going so far. Um, let's see. Uh, at least pull up the settings and give you an idea where I've got this dialed into. Alright, I've got it on movie mode. Like I said, after I boosted the luminance, this seems a lot brighter. Um, I had to go into the uh, service menu to do all that. And um, if anybody has any questions, just ask and I'll... Uh, I'll post a comment describing how I did all that. But, um, let's see. These are the current settings I have running to push it the way it's going. Uh, for my clarity settings. What the hell? I had blur reduction up to 7. I wonder if it's... Yeah, I've noticed the settings sometimes adjust themselves, too. I think it depends on the content you're playing. It moves the, uh, I think when it changes the gamma or something, it, uh, um, because the gamma has different settings depending on the, the color space. Um, yeah, it ends up causing things to switch around and changes some of the other settings, so you sometimes have to go and make an adjustment after, uh, after you change different content. But, um, native has always been tried and true for everything I've seen to play on it. Um, shadow detail always at 5 because why do you want to screw yourself out of details? And uh, Warm 2 I found uh, adds that extra touch of um, uh, nice balance to the richness of the colors. Uh, contrast enhancer on high really draws out those details too. Now with the gamma boost and the contrast high I, um, or I'm sorry, with the luminance boost and the contrast high, I had to bring the gamma down a hair in order to balance all that out so it wasn't like washed out or whatever. But yeah, so far everything's coming together beautifully. Um, but yeah, uh, I hope this helps some of you guys get some of the most out of your TV. I found this works for SDR, HDR, uh, virtually anything I play in movie mode with these settings seems to come together exactly how I want it, or at least as good as this TV can deliver. Um, all right, well. Thanks for your time.